Good morning, welcome back to the vlog. We are on the boat this morning. Look where you're going. Look where you're going. We're heading into Ambleside this morning, which is the most northerly town on Lake Windermere. The weather is not quite as sunny today. It's still it's still pretty warm, however. I'm still wearing a t-shirt. Just waiting for that sun to break for us. I'm so strong. No, you're not. Look at your biceps. <laughs> <laughs> Thank Look you. Yeah. <coughs> I don't really even know. <laughs> I don't know what this is. Between the lakeside and Ambleside, the village, there is about a one mile walk. However, there is this electric bus which, which takes people for two pound each. So we decided if we couldn't be bothered walking, then we, uh, we got the bus. I'm scared, I'm scared for my life, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Scream if you want to go faster! <laughs> Alright, we're just getting a coffee and a bit of food in this cafe here behind me called Daisy's Cafe. This is probably one of mine and George's uh, joint favourite place in the whole of the Lake District. And the reason for that is they do these amazing homemade scones, which I have ordered one of. Yes please, thank you. How is it? Really nice. Because it's homemade, you can tell it's really fresh. Nice. I think I'm exposed. Mate, you can't just leave fresh clotted cream without eating it. I'm carb loaded for this weekend's race. And it's only, it's only Thursday. It's clotted cream. <laughs> yeah. Good for you, it's good for the bones. Frozen. Well, I know, I know, I know. We never really know. So give me out. All right, we're just packing up now. Georgia has to head home this afternoon, so we're gonna drive back down to my house and then she's gonna get the train home. It's been an awesome few days up here in the Lake District. We've had pretty, pretty awesome weather as far as Lake District weather goes. You said to be going home, Joe. Yeah, I love it here. Do you like being by the water? Yes, and I like boats. <laughs> So this evening's plan is I'm gonna do the chain gang, uh, the the Thursday night, the Thursday night chain gang that you guys always see me doing. I took Georgia straight to uh, straight to Manchester train station where she, where she's gonna get the train back back to her house, and I allowed a lot of time. However, it turns out tonight the motorways have just turned to sh**, and. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna be late. The chain gang starts at 6.45. It's a 15 minute ride. So basically I need to set off from my house at 6.30. Uh, currently my sat nav says I'm gonna be home by 6.13. That gives me 17 minutes to get home, get changed, get my kit on and get out the door. Providing there is no more traffic. I am 15 minutes away so that, that number at uh, 6.14 now, it just keeps going up and up. Either way, it's gonna be tight. Wish me luck. That was the fastest turnaround to get my kit on ever. But we've made it out of the house. We've, uh, we've got a headwind out, which isn't ideal, but I just remembered that we, uh, that in our chain gang, you've got the A group and the B group. The B group set off about three minutes ahead of us. So me and the A group, we actually set off at about 47, 48 past the hour. That buys me a couple of extra minutes, but I mean, it's still gonna be tight. It's gonna be real tight. So 
Didn't have time to pick up my GoPro tonight, so I didn't really get much footage from uh, from the chain gang. As you can imagine, we're going fast, it's through and off. So it's a little bit irresponsible to pull out a camera, but uh, we had a tailwind up the climb that I took the KOM a couple of weeks ago, the, that uh, that leg burner KOM, I don't know if you remember it. But we had a tailwind up that climb today, so I tried to uh, I tried to better that time. So we'll wait and see till I get home, put it on Strava and see if I've beaten my own KOM. But I'm just headed home now, so that's gonna be the end of today's video. Guys, thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please drop a thumbs up. Oh, and as always, I'll see you tomorrow.